Hello, everyone. Thank you all for joining. We're going to start the presentation and the webinar. Uh, please make sure that uh, no one like turns on their webcam or unmute themselves. And today we're going to talk about a very, very interesting topic and products that you all love. I'm sure and all of you have tried them before, which are the C9 and the F15. OK, so weight management programs and how to use them exactly and who should not be using the C9 and F15, okay? And then, of course, at the end, you can, ask, you can ask all your questions as usual. Okay, so let's start. So first, we're gonna start with the Clean9. Okay, the C9 is the first program of the FIT programs. So the FIT uh, constitutes of C9, of F15, and also of um the vital five today we're not going to talk about the vital five because vital five is just for maintenance and today i decided to talk just really and focus mostly on the weight management on how to lose weight with these programs that can benefit you and also your team members and um that can actually also get you a lot of clients and customers if you know how to really like talk about the products in the correct way okay so as you all know, the C9 comes in a box. You will, you will find a box uh, of C9 like the one in the photo. And you will also find five products inside the C9. Uh, today, please just so that everyone can know that today the webinar will be in English and tomorrow will be in Arabic. يوم المحاضرة حتكون بالإنجليزي وبكرة بالعربي. بس لا تعرفوا. Please make sure no one puts their webcam. Thank you. Okay, so let's continue. Uh, I was I was saying I was talking about the C9 box. So the C9 you will receive it uh, as it is, as you can see in the picture, and you will find inside five products. You will find two aloe vera gel, you will find a mini uh, fit kit, the C9 kit, and also the Forever Light Ultra Shape. Okay, now we're going to talk about each one in detail. Uh, the C9 program is usually a cleansing program. It will help detox your body, to clean your body actually, and it's good for the digestive system, also to help you uh, in case you, don't, you have a problem with increasing your nutrient absorption, it can help you with that. And of course, getting more nutrients, um, cleaning your body as we said and just to put you on a on the right path to have a healthier lifestyle to also have um like a discipline which can help you later on lose weight okay so it's a nine days program usually now sometimes you can find uh, something called c9 21 days uh, where you find you will find the whole bottles of serum and garcinia but now let's focus only on the c9 for the, the nine days Okay, so as we start, okay, can you look better and feel better in just nine days? Of course, the answer is going to be yes. The Clean Nine program can help you can help to jumpstart your journey to a slimmer, healthier you. This effective, easy to follow cleansing program will help will give you the tools you need to start transforming your body today. Okay, so in case people want just like an, a push or an, a nice. Um, like program to help them lose weight in a healthy way, we can give them the C9. And of course, later on, they'll be motivated to start on their own, their own lifestyle, their own diet, their own, you know, uh, nutrition program. So this is just like a push and start and uh, they, can, they, will be, they will feel actually motivated because it helps them lose weight, it helps them to exercise more, to eat healthier. So it's really just like, it's amazing um to to start with now let's continue take each product as directed in the supplement schedule for maximum results okay we're going to talk about each product i just want to mention something here the c9 you will receive also a booklet so not only so as we said here you will receive five products you will also receive the mini chest and uh, a booklet. Booklet is very important, guys, if you can read it every time before you start the C9. Because a lot of people, they, they, they call the customer service or they want to talk to me and they tell me, I don't know how to use the C9. But the booklet is really, really super easy. 
And now I, I actually took some, some parts of the booklet to explain it to you in details. Okay, so always read the booklet before you start the C9 and read it all. Okay, so all details. It's very easy. It can tell you exactly how to use the products. It tell you exactly um, what to exercise and how to exercise. Also, what recipes and food you should eat. Okay, so let's start. You will find, as we said, five products. The first one is the Forever Aloe Vera Gel, of course. Why? Because it helps cleanse the digestive system and maximize uh, absorption of nutrients, okay? So the aloe vera gel, you will find two bottles of one liter. Then uh, you will find forever fiber. Uh, it provides actually a pro uh, proprietary blend of five grams of water soluble fiber that can help you promote, um, that can help you actually feel uh, full, okay? So the fiber you take it, this is why we, 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 we drink the fiber in the C9 because it can help you feel full and um, it doesn't have a lot of calories actually and it's very easy to use. It's, it's a very healthy, like it's a nice and easy snack to, to eat and drink. Third is the Forever Therm. The Forever Therm offers a powerful combination of botanical extracts and vitamins that can help support the metabolism. For the people who don't know, the Forever Therm, it contains caffeine and also raspberry ketones. These are really good to, to help you increase your metabolism, to help you also burn more fat, especially if you're going to exercise. Okay, this is why you need to exercise um, whenever you're taking all these supplements. It will help you lose weight and fat easier. Then we have the Garcinia Plus. The Garcinia uh, can help the body uh, also burn fat and it's an appetite suppressant and it, it increases serotonin levels, as we said, as, as you can see. And lastly, the Forever Light Ultra Shake, it's a mix of, um, you know, vitamins and minerals and protein, of course. It contains 17 grams of protein per serving. So you can mix it with milk and you will receive even more protein. Okay, so it's a very nice, uh, like, uh, really good formation of product that you can take together. It's a combination of really, a uh, nice product that you need to, 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 to take all of them together to have really the best result. Okay, now we're going to talk about more about how to take these products. So for now, it's all easy, right, guys? So as, as, as I talked about the products that how you can take them or, or what are actually the products in the box. And now we're going to talk about how you need to take these supplements. Now, before we do that, you just need to know, uh, to follow these steps, okay, to achieve your best results. First is weigh and measure yourself before you begin. Always measure yourself before and at the end of the C9. Also, re uh, record your daily exercise, food intake, and how you feel while on the program in the C9 booklet. So in the booklet, you will find that you can write down, for example, what did you exercise? What did you eat today? And how are you feeling? This will help you actually uh, to keep on motivating you and you will not like uh, eat more or you know feel lazy and not exercise. Also drink plenty of water. Drinking eight glasses of water a day can actually help you feel full. It can help you like remove toxins. It can actually help to support the skin health, okay? And optimal health. So always, so always drink a lot of water, especially when you're doing the C9 because we don't want you to be dehydrated and you're also working out and you're taking some supplements. So drink a lot of water. Also, put down the salt shaker. So salt contributes to fluid retention. So try not to add salt to your diet and so flavor your foods with herbs and spices instead. And lastly, avoid sodas and carbonated beverages because uh, carbonation promotes bloating. You will feel bloated and your stomach is not gonna really, like the, the digestion is going to be annoying, okay? So drinking soda also adds unwanted calories and sugar. These are some tips that you need to follow before starting your C9 or also while on your C9. Now let's move to the first two days. Okay, now please guys, I want you to focus really well. Um, this is a detailed explanation of on how to use the C9 on the first two days. Now, the first two days, of course, uh, you only use our products. Okay, please, it's very important, guys. 
you can also eat some free food. We will discuss this later, but mainly you do not eat one meal that contains some calories from outside, like um, like rice or protein or anything. No, you just eat our, you take our products and you can have some small free food that we're gonna talk about. So this is only for two days, okay? First, the breakfast. You start by taking two Garcinia tablets. Okay, so start by two Garcinia tablets, then you wait 20 minutes. If you want to write this down, you can do this, okay, for people who don't know how to use C9. So you start by taking two Garcinia, you wait 20 minutes, and then you drink aloe vera gel, uh, which is four ounces, okay, with eight ounces of water. So it's, uh, it's almost like 120 milliliters of aloe vera gel with 240 milliliters of water. Then you take one therm. Okay, and then you can exercise. This is regarding breakfast. Now, for snack. Now, if some people ask me what time should breakfast be, it depends whenever you guys wake up, but it's, it's always good to have it early, for example, around, you know, from 7 till 11. Don't, don't have it later or even before that, like 7 to 10. So, for example, 8, 9, 10, it's fine. Then you can have a snack around 11, around, you know, 12, whenever you feel hungry before your lunch. You, you mix one sachet of fiber with water, okay, usually, and you mix it and you drink it. This will make you feel full, okay? You, you will feel full whenever you drink the fiber. So this is for snack. Now, for lunch, usually lunch should be also like around one, two, or three maximum. Don't, don't have a late lunch. So that way you're, you're eating healthy, you're eating every three hours, uh, a nice and small meal. Uh, okay, so then for lunch, you will take also two Garcinia, then you will wait also another 20 minutes or 30 minutes. Now it's saying here 30 minutes, but you can wait 20 to 30 minutes. It depends on you guys, okay? 20 is fine and 30 is fine. Then you drink also another four ounces of aloe vera gel with water. Then it, you, you mix one scoop of light ultra. This is, this is going to be your lunch. The light ultra is going to be your lunch. You mix one scoop of light ultra with water or almond milk. Guys, please mute your, mute your Okay. Is there someone named Afsane? Uh, please mute your phone. It's it's unmuting on its own. Thank you. Okay, let's continue. So um, I was saying, yeah, for lunch. So we talked about the Garcinia, we talked about the aloe vera gel, and now you need to mix one scoop of light ultra with milk or with uh, water. It's up to you. Okay, and then you take one tablet of therm as well. Tablet of therm, always make sure the last one is at lunch. Okay, don't take it late because you will feel uh, hyper because it has a bit of, it gives you energy actually. So don't take it at night or else you, you will not sleep well because it contains a bit of caffeine. Then uh, the, for dinner, you need to also take another two tablets of Garcinia wait another 20 to 30 minutes and drink at the end also aloe vera gel four ounces okay and then before going to sleep you will also drink four ounces of aloe vera gel this is for day one and two only so the only uh, thing you do is just drink aloe vera gel take the garcinia the therm also one sachet of fiber and of course the light ultra shake for lunch okay it's very easy I know it's a bit hard actually, like you might feel hungry, you might feel tired because you're not eating a meal, but I mean, the fo to follow the program is really easy, like everything is written in detail in the, in the booklet, so all you have to do is just follow the booklet and the, the, tab the, the table uh, of the booklet. Now, if you're really hungry, you can have some free foods, I will talk about them in a bit, okay, for example, like broccoli, like spinach, cucumber, a bit of fruits. Uh, just one serving, we're going to talk about this. So this is usually uh, regarding the C9, okay, for day one and two. Now let's go to day three and day 
to day nine. So to day three to day nine, you start eating more, okay? So you will have, you we will add another like calorie. We'll add another meal, I mean, which is a 600 calorie meal. Okay, let's go first in breakfast. So breakfast is a bit different. So you start with two tablets of Garcinia, okay? Then you wait 30 minutes. Then you drink the aloe vera gel with water. Then you take one scoop of light ultra, okay? And also one therm. So as you can see here, we added the light ultra to, um, to the breakfast. Then for a snack, you take one fiber, okay? Then for lunch, also you take two Garcinia, you drink one light ultra shake, one scoop, I mean, with milk, okay? And you take one therm. Then for dinner, you take also two tablets of Garcinia. Then here you eat a 600 calorie meal plan. Okay, so we will talk about also the 600 calorie meal plan in a bit. What are the foods that you can eat? It's very easy. Usually it's, it's something like protein, which is cooked or grilled protein, a bit, with, a bit of carbs next to it, for example, a bit of rice, a bit of beans, and a salad. Always try to include salad or veggies in your meal. Okay? Um, and of course, before going to sleep, you just drink water. Okay, so guys, it's very easy. Here we reduced a little bit the aloe vera gel, and we we introduced a new a new meal plan, which is a 600 calorie meal plan. Now, don't forget to exercise as well. 30 minutes exercise, okay, every day. It, it can be a low impact exercise. You don't need to like really kill yourself or run or like it's up to you, whatever you feel good for your body, try to do it, but you have to exercise, okay? It can go, it can be like a brisk walking, it can be a bit of jogging, it can be swimming, anything you want, just try to sweat and try to work out and do some steps, like move. Now, uh, I'm gonna talk here about the free foods. Remember I told you that whenever you're hungry, you can have some free foods, okay? Throughout the Clean Nine program. And um, just try not to increase the quantity. So here you will you will find a three tables actually. You will find the one serving foods. One serving foods that means you can only have one of these, okay, per day. For example, you can have three apricots or one medium apple or one artichoke, one cup of blackberries or blueberries. Okay, so you can you can follow the table as what it says. Then you can have two servings, so you can have two of these like two tomatoes, for example, uh, two uh, or two, uh, like 16 asparagus, a bell pepper also two. okay? These are two serving foods. And lastly, the free foods, these you can have unlimited qual quantity of these foods. For example, the celery, the green onion, lettuce, you can eat it all day. Uh, of course, like I don't really recommend eating it all day, of course not, but just whenever you're hungry or, or whenever you're craving something to eat, Try to, to, to choose from the free foods because they're really, really low in calories, okay? And you can have as much as you want. But of course, don't eat a lot, Yani. Just try to, um, whenever you're just really hungry and whenever you want to stop these cravings. Okay, also broccoli, cucumber, eggplant, kale, spinach, beans, string beans, of course. Okay, so these are free foods that you can eat throughout the C9. So it's not really like you're not starving yourself. Okay, I don't want you to feel like uh, you're so tired, you're gonna faint, or you, you're no, because this is not the the idea of the program. The idea of the program is to have discipline, to know how to to eat healthier food options, to know how to exercise, um, to know what to eat, what to what to follow, how to take the supplements. Okay, it's very easy. Usually people actually do not feel hungry because they're cleaning their body from, from everything. So it's good to have these two days of really just cleaning your body because you know, guys, we eat a lot of junk food nowadays and a lot of food is not really healthy for us. So it's good to detox your whole body and to clean it out and to, to, make, to make sure that your digestive system is, um, is relaxed. Now, uh, the next, uh, slide is about the 500 to 600 calorie meals 
And these are some quick and easy meal ideas that you can do uh, during the day three to day nine, right? We said that you can eat 500 to 600 calories. Guys, please make sure your phone is muted, please. Okay. Uh, so the first one, for example, is chicken and rice, as I said. So it gives you like how many uh, like ounces of chicken you can do and like two cups of vegetables, for example. Okay, so it's very easy to make. Just follow the, the booklet. I told you guys, if you really follow the booklet, in details you will not feel like you will not be lost everything is super easy and everything is in the booklet also for example you can eat salmon okay with a bit of uh, like small sweet potato a bit of cinnamon uh, just and some vegetables very easy also some turkey some burrito bowl this is very nice a bit of rice with you can add your pinto beans okay beans are really healthy and a bit of, for example, chicken. So whatever you guys want, just make sure it doesn't it doesn't exceed your calories uh, of 600. Now, of course, you can nowadays with Google, you can really just calculate the calories. You can say, for example, um, you can just see, for example, grilled chicken calories, and they will give you. So you can know exactly or approximately how much of um, calories is, is in each food group. Okay. So now, okay, we finished the C9. Okay, now we're gonna move to, yes, okay, so we have a question here. I will, of course, I will answer at the end, but I will answer just this one now. Uh, regarding meals for vegetarians, so just remove the, the animal product or the animal protein and just replace it with vegetarian protein. For example, like lentils, beans, tofu, uh, okay, so anything like uh, you guys eat, for example, chickpeas, uh, chickpeas, sorry. So whatever you guys like for vegetarians, okay, as long as it contains some, a bit of protein, this would be good. So mix protein and with carbs. Uh, also, like, for example, spinach you can add, okay, as I said, tofu, spinach, a bit of, I don't know if you like eggs, uh, some cheese, um, just anything you want. Protein with a bit of carbs, it's always good. And of course, vegetables. Every day, try to eat a salad next to your food. Now, let's move. Okay, so we finished the C9. Of course, I'm gonna take all your questions in a bit. Uh, now we're gonna move to F15. So F15, I did not go into details as much as the C9 because it's almost the same thing. The only difference is the calories, okay, of the food. Let's, let's move to this. I will show it to you. So, this is the, the F15 box. The F15 box contains exactly the same um, products of the C9, of course, but for longer period of time, so for two weeks, for 15 days. And you, need, you will need to eat more, but you also have to exercise. So this is also another step after the C9 to continue, if you want to continue your weight management program, if you want to continue to lose weight, it's good to, to do the, C, the F15 because it, uh, the C9 has really low calories. The F15 has more calories, so that way you will not feel tired. You can do it for two weeks and you will also be losing weight as well. So as you all know, we have the beginner of F15, we have the intermediate, and we also have the advanced. Today, I'm just gonna talk about the beginner. It's almost like, it's, uh, it's almost the same for beginner, intermediate, and advanced in, in regarding to the products, I mean. But if we're going to talk about the, the, what's the difference between them, basically it's the exercise and, and, and it's also the meal plans. Okay, so this is why uh, for people who don't exercise a lot, we give them the beginner. Then for people who exercise, we give them the intermediate. And lastly, for people who exercise a lot or, or, or who are athletes, we give them the advanced. So always good to start with the canine first, just to you know to make your body used to this program and to the products, and then move to the F15. Now this is the schedule. Okay, we don't have the first day or two days or no. The schedule is the same for the 15 days, and this is how you start. For breakfast, also you start with two garcinia, then you you wait 20 to 30 minutes, then you drink the aloe vera gel. And then you take one scoop of Forever Light Ultra and you mix it with water or with milk. And then you take one therm. Okay, this is for breakfast. 
So for two weeks, it's, 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 it's the exact same, the exact same um, uh, table and schedule. Then for snack, you take one fiber, you mix it with water, okay? And then you, you need to eat 200 calorie snack. What does it mean 200 calorie snack? You can always go to the booklet and they, they, put, they will give you some ideas of what are 200 calorie snacks, okay? You will find everything in the booklet. Uh, for example, some uh, you know, rice cakes, some, um, um, for example, uh, popcorn, of course, like healthy popcorn. I don't put butter or anything. Uh, some yogurt, okay? These are all healthy snacks. Um, for example, hummus with some veggies. Okay, so you just open the booklet and you read and you choose your snack, which ones you like, and you can do it. Then for lunch, also two Garcinia and one therm. You wait a little bit, you wait 20 to 30 minutes, and then you can have one meal. It's 50 calories for women and 550 for men. Guys, please mute your phone. Okay. All right, so uh, I hope you, you all heard me. So I was saying, you got in lunch, you take two Garcinia, one therm, and also you eat one meal, which is 450 calories. So the 450 calories is also like something around, for example, um, you know, like some uh, grilled steak, for example, or grilled fish, a bit of um, vegetables, a bit of uh, cheese. It's up to you what you guys like. Okay, but just make sure that it's around uh, 450 calories for women and 550 calories for men. You can find also everything in the booklet. So everything is very easy. Uh, you just need to follow it. And you can also create your perfect meal. So in the booklet of the F15, they give you how much calories uh, are things. For example, if you turn to the page, you can see, for example, that um, also, there are some vegetarian options, for example, like lentils. They tell you that, that um, around half a cup, it's around 200 calories for men, okay? So you can just check and see, actually for women, sorry, and for men, it's three quarters of a cup, okay? So you to open the booklet and you read the calories. It's very, very easy. Then, regarding the... Guys, just keep someone named uh, Aish. He's me. Uh, it's on. It's on muting all the time. Yes. Okay. Is, uh, someone named Aish. Please mute your phone. Okay, guys. So we're gonna continue. I'm sorry for this. I, I'm 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 muting everyone, but so, someone is uh, is unmuting by themselves. I don't know why. Anyway, let's continue. Sorry for that. Okay. So as I said, you can open the F15 booklet and you can make you can choose it. Everything is written with the your meals okay for example the carbohydrates the protein the fats and you can choose how many calories are in each so you can see for example fish um four ounces of fish is around 150 calories for women okay so just it's very easy everything is really uh, very easy in the booklet that then for dinner you need to also eat the same thing as for lunch but without the therm tablet so you take two garcinia you also wait 20 minutes or 30 minutes, and then you, you eat 450 calorie dinner for women and 550 calorie dinner for men. Okay, and then at the end, of course, evening, before going to sleep, don't forget to drink water. Do drink water actually throughout the whole day, but of course also before going to sleep. Okay, and don't forget to exercise. So in the F15, you, you will also find a lot of exercises also in detail. Very easy, they will start, for example, with a bit of cardio, a bit of strength exercises, a bit of yoga. You can choose what you guys like and just do it. Okay, so 
that was it for the FFT. I'm not gonna go really into details because each uh, program is really different. So each the beginner is different, the advanced is uh, different, and also the intermediate is different. But it's all the same um, schedule of products. Okay, this is the exact same schedule of products. So just check it out and ask me all your questions if you guys have. And it's very easy, guys. Really, like you can just also open, as I said, and you can check each calories of each food group, and you can make your own calorie and your own meal plan. Now, uh, don't you don't choose this product, okay? Or the aloe vera gel, for example, if you are pregnant, if you are lactating, if you just had a stroke, for example, last week or something, try not to, to drink it as well. And um, the Garcinia, don't take it if you have kidney problems, okay? Or diabetes, you can, okay? But of course, we don't, like if you're on insulin, it's better if you don't, okay? Also, if you have problems with the CNS, which is the central nervous system, the fiber, don't take it. If you have difficulty with regulating blood sugar, if you don't have any difficulty, then it's fine. You can take the fiber. It's, it's usually harmless. Uh, also, the therm, if you have any reaction to caffeine, if you have high blood pressure, don't take therm. Okay, please, this is very important. High blood pressure, don't take therm. Heart conditions as well. Uh, heart conditions, it's okay as long as it's controlled, you know, but just make sure that blood pressure mostly. Kidney disease, uh, hyper, hyperthyroidism, and liver disease and iron deficiency. And lastly, liver disorder, or if you're taking any hormone therapy replacement, try to uh, avoid the forever light ultra. Okay, so these are the products of the C9 and of the F15. So you can take a picture of this slide, of course, and um, just make sure everyone is healthy, guys, before doing these programs. Or you can always ask us and send customer service an email, and I can help you. Uh, because we don't want any side effects, you know. But usually, all these programs, if someone's healthy, they're very, they're very healthy. Nothing's gonna happen to you, and you will actually, you will find a really good benefit of your digestive system. You're gonna take care of your digestive system. You're gonna lose weight in a healthy way. You're gonna really be disciplined more and uh, you're gonna start to have a healthy lifestyle okay so now guys if you have any questions please go ahead and ask me okay we have a question here can we take protein as a dinner replacement instead of taking it in daytime uh, yes you can of course so if you want you can mix the protein you can do it at night and for lunch you can take the 600 calorie uh, of the one uh, of dinner and take it for lunch. So the the, the importance of this uh, is, is the calories. As long as you're in a calorie deficit and you're exercising, then it's fine if it's easier for you. So guys, go ahead and ask all your questions. Can we follow with only vegetarian diet? Yes, of course. So if you are a vegetarian, you can definitely do the C9 and the F15 with the vegetarian diet. As I said, just um, substitute the animal products with um, plant-based products and, uh, and protein. For example, like lentils, like black beans, uh, tofu, edamame. Okay, so all these, can, they can help even if you want, for example, if uh, you're not vegan and you want some cheese to add, you can add some cheese. Okay, so just make sure what you guys like, what, you, what your body is used to and just eat a healthy meal basically. But of course, avoid as much as you can. Don't never like fry food, always eat food that are really like grilled um, okay, or boiled. Just don't, don't fry food at all and um, avoid sugar foods and refined carbs and processed food. Okay, can you suggest some exercise? Yeah, of course, so exercise, you can also find everything in the, the booklet, but you can do some, for example, brisk walking, some jogging, some swimming, it depends what you guys like. Okay, so each body is different what you might like, some people, some other people might not. Just as long as you're exercising for 30 minutes, any type of exercise uh, per day, it would be good. Also do some, like for example, some hit 
like some squats, some abs. These are really good as well. You can do them at home or in the gym. Another question, can we do egg diet with F15 to lose more weight? For example, an egg diet, only boiled eggs and apple and green tea allowed. You can do it, but just guys, don't do extreme diets. It's not very healthy. Just do a normal healthy diet, okay, healthy meal plan. Uh, as I said, a bit of protein, a bit of carbs, a bit of uh, veggies, a bit of good fats, okay? And that's it. And you can, of course, eat some eggs, like whenever you want, but don't just go extreme because you're only eating one meal plan anyway. Okay, if someone is more obese after C9, when they can start Fit15? I didn't understand your question. If someone is more obese after C9, what do you mean? Like if someone is still obese after C9 and they want to do Fit15, yes, they can do it, of course. Like they can do it directly right after the C9. Okay, how to count 600 calories? I said, Samira, everything is in the booklet. So you can open the booklet of the F15. They tell you each pro, each, uh, uh, for example, uh, like for example, the serving of each food, how many calories is it? And you can just try to add them together or you can check on Google. They will tell you each food group, uh, how many calories you will find in, in the serving. Can a PCOS patient have these for weight loss? Yes, you can give uh, C9 and F15 for PCOS, no problem. Bronchitis person can do the C9? Yes, it's fine. Is it possible to use both C9 and F15 and not lose weight? Usually, no, you cannot do that because uh, of course you will lose weight. Usually, like, of course, if you're doing either C9 or F15, um, you need to lose weight, but don't focus on your weight, focus on the fat mainly. So if you're exercising, because muscle also can, can weigh, but if you're exercising well, if you're following exactly the meal plan, if, every, if you're following exactly the schedule, uh, hopefully you will definitely lose weight. But of course, as I said, each body is different. If people did not lose weight, that means maybe they have some problems with their, um, with their vitamin, with their hormone, just make sure that they are healthy, okay? Okay, we have a question here. After F15, what do you recommend for a person who wants to reduce 30 kgs? So if after F15, they can increase the intensity of workout and they can do another F15, but with, which is, for example, intermediate or advanced, okay? Make them do more exercise to help them burn more calories. After C9, when they can start with the F15? Directly, right away. Um, why lots of products are out of stock in UAE? We are waiting, guys, for the shipment. How many C9 can a person do in a month? So usually C9, it's only, it's only better to do it four times a year. Okay, don't do it in a month a lot or, or else your body is going to get used to it and you will not lose weight anymore. So only do C9 four times a year. How much gap can we give between C9 and F15? Usually you can try, you can start that right away, but if you want to give a gap, they can take, for example, five days gap, okay? Just let them eat healthy in this gap and exercise as well. There are two C9, one is Garcinia plus in bottles and other is in blister form, is there any difference? The only difference is that uh, the, the full bottle, it will last longer, that's it. But the, the blister form is the same, Garcinia. But one is for shorter period of time, that's it. One is for nine days, the other is for 21 days. Okay. Can a person who recently had COVID do C9? Uh, yes, of course, if someone is feeling healthy and there are no more symptoms, no more side effects of the COVID, and they want to, you know, like lose weight or just, you know, uh, cl clean their body, they can do the C9. Diabetic people can do the C9. And who has menses problem? Do they do C9 by nectar instead of aloe vera gel? Okay, this is a very good question. So for diabetic people, I do not recommend doing the C9 because it's a bit harsh and it's very low in calories. Okay, so especially if they are taking insulin. If, they want, if diabetic people want to lose weight, they can maybe do the S15 because it has more calories throughout the day, okay? Uh, or at least they, they need to eat uh, 
several meals a day because we don't want their blood sugar level to uh, actually uh, go down and they do, we don't want them to feel dizzy. Uh, but regarding someone who has uh, menstrual, like, like girls who are on their menstrual cycle, usually I don't recommend them doing the C9. They can finish their menstrual cycle then to do the C9. And if they have some problems, you mean with the hormones, uh, still, no, don't give them the berry nectar uh, with the C9 because uh, just give them the normal aloe vera gel because actually the uh, the berry nectar contains more sugar than the yellow bottle, okay? So the yellow bottle can help really like reduce weight uh, because it contains less calories. Can high blood pressure people do C9 with garlic thyme instead of therm? Uh, yes, yes, you can do that. Just remove the therm as long as there's no therm, then it's fine. Can pregnant women use ultralight? Yes, the shake, yes. But of course, everything, whenever a pregnant woman wants to take anything, always check with the doctor first. Okay, guys? Just any tablet, any supplement, any shake even. Which product we should use for white menstruation problem? What do you mean white menstruation problem? Yeah, white discharge, uh, we do not have really something like, specifically for that. Uh, for white discharge, it's always good to go to the gyno because uh, they will give you specific, it might be a bacteria, it might be something else. Um, so you can you can still take, you know, vitalites or belly nectar because it can help, you know, with the whole reproductive system, but it's not, it doesn't mean that it will remove the discharge, okay? So always better to check with the doctor. Um, okay, another question. Is there any mood alteration supplement for menopausal women? You can, you can give them vitalized women and gentia. It can help actually with the symptoms of the menopause. Can we take pulses or black chickpeas during C9? Yes, you can. Uh, just as long as it's within the calories, you know, don't, don't overdo it. As long as it's around 500 calories, your meal with some salad on the side, you can. Which program is more heavy? I mean, which, which can help to lose fat more quickly? It depends, of course, on each body. Now, of course, the C9 is a bit more strict because it has less um, calories or less intake of calories throughout the day. So you can, I always recommend that you start with the C9 and then slowly shift to F15. Can a recent heart patient use aloe vera gel? Uh, what happened to him? Like recent, recently, I, I, I prefer not. He can check with his doctor first. What is recommended for leukorrhea? What do you mean leukorrhea? Is it like leukemia? Or what is it exactly? Just to be more specific. If someone has continuously menstrual bleeding and hypothyroid, what shall we give? So continuous menstrual bleeding, uh, it's always better to go check with their gyno. They can give them some pills to balance their hormones. But of course, we can also try with the vitalized women. It can help balance their hormones naturally. And uh, for hypothyroid, uh, like what do you need if they need to? Because hypothyroid also, like they need another uh, medicine. But you can give them the daily or, uh, of course, the aloe vera gel, some arctic sea. Okay, and if they want to lose weight, they can take therm. For pies, uh, usually also just go to the pharmacy and some, they will give you something exactly for that. Okay. Um, like we do not have really something for that. Just eat a lot of fiber, food. Not, don't take the sachet fiber. I mean, eat like some uh, vegetables, some fruit. And um, you can put a bit of uh, the, the, the 
allolips, okay, around the, the area if it's hurting, but uh, just also you need something specifically for that. Okay, we talked about the white discharge. We, we talked about the white discharge. I said that it's better to check with the gyno because sometimes it can be bacteria, sometimes it can be something else. So it depends on each really, on each uh, body. I cannot generalize, okay? But as I said, for women, usually for the reproductive system, for their health, take vitalized women, take some a small amount of berry nectar, and some gentia, for example, and of course, eat healthy and exercise. For anal uh, fistula problems, as said also, um, we don't really have something specifically for that. Just eat some foods that are high in fiber, high in greens. Uh, even, for example, fields of greens is good. Um, even the super greens, and you can, you can put a bit of uh, the aloe lips around the area or the jelly. But as I said, these are just some natural, you know, like um, substitution, but you can always go and treat it directly with a doctor or with, with a pharmacy. Okay, so I'm not sure it always works for everyone. For irregular menstrual problems, you can give uh, the vitalized women just to balance the hormones, a bit of berry nectar and gentia as well can help. Can we recommend C9 to cancer patient when she has done all her chemo and radiation just on medicine for 10 years now, need weight loss? Yes, if she doesn't have any cancer, if she finished, if she finished her chemo and other medicines, uh, and I mean, in radiation, yes, she can do the C9. For tingling in fingers, what is recommended? Is there any weakness? So for tingling in fingers, like you can give something for, you know, like the nervous system, which is the Ginkgo, the Arctic C, or the B12, they can all help with the tingling and the weakness of the finger. Any other questions, guys, before we end the presentation? What product can a diabetic patient who have both high and low sugar problems have to lose weight? You have, you has both high and low sugar problems. Okay, so for diabetic, you can give them the fields of greens, the aloe vera gel, and the tea. Okay, for now, uh, just make sure they exercise, they eat healthy. Which product should we use for a healthy hair growth? So for healthy hair growth, you can take Nature Men. Um, also, you can just add some aloe first, some jelly on the scalp, massage it, alpha E factor can help, and of course the shampoo, the conditioner, okay, but take the Nature Mint tablets, it, it helps because it has iron, and even also royal jelly can help. Move freedom and, and HA has same effect on muscular activity, uh, yes, they, they all are good for joints, and uh, but for the muscular no like for the muscles we usually give move if you want more than the ha ha for is for um joints even move is for joints but i mean for muscles you mean like yeah move yes you can regarding the aloe vera and the aloe blossom herbicide as long as they're exercising and they're eating healthy Okay, guys, so I think we're going to end the presentation. Thank you all for joining. And um, I hope we will also meet very soon with another presentation. Okay, have a lovely afternoon and stay healthy. Bye, guys.